Howard Taft, and I was born September 15, 1857, in Cincinnati, Ohio, where I also grew up. My family was very powerful. My father was Alfonso Taft, who was a state judge, a secretary of war, and an attorney general, and other sorts of things. My mother was Louisa Torrey. I have two half-brothers, two real brothers, and one sister. In my adulthood, I had a wife. Her name was Helen, also known as Nellie. She was the daughter of a judge. I had three children, Charles Phelps Taft II, Helen Heron Taft Manning, and Robert Alfonso Taft. <laughs> my education consisted of Woodward High School in Cincinnati, Yale, and Cincinnati Law School. I was a Bachelor of Laws. First, I was assistant prosecutor of Hamilton County, Ohio, and then, in 1882, I became local collector of internal revenue. After that, in, in 1887, appointed judge of Ohio Superior Court. Next, I was the fifth U.S. Solicitor General from February 1890 to March 1892, and then I was judge of U.S. Court of Appeals from March 1892 to March 1900. After that, I became the first civil governor of the Philippines from July 4, 1901 to December 23, 1902. Then, I was the 42nd U.S. Secretary of War from February 1, 1904 to June 30, 1908. After that, I was the first provisional governor of Cuba from September 29, 1906 to October 13, 1906. Then, I became the 10th Chief Justice of the United States from June 30, 1921. Wait, June 30th, 1921, to February 3rd, 1930. I was nominated by President Harding. After that, I became the president. From March 4th, 1909 to March 4th, 1913, my vice president was James Sherman. In the presidential election, my opponents were William Jennings Bryan, who ran as a Democrat, Eugene V. Debs, who ran as a Socialist, Thomas Lewis Hig Higgin, who ran as an independent, and Thomas Edwards Watson, who was a populist. The results were, I got 321 electoral votes to 162 electoral votes, who the Democrat got, who was William Jennings Bryan. I got 7,678,395 popular votes, which is 51.6%. And the Democrat got 6,408,984 Democratic votes. My campaigning slash platform <laughs> was, was dollar diplomacy, which protected U.S. business ventures in foreign countries. I let the party rule and just went with the grain. I also broke up twice as many trusts as Roosevelt, who was my predecessor. I was a Republican and served four years as president in the White House. Three of my prominent cabinet members were Philander C. Knox, the Secretary of State, Franklin McVean. In my own eyes, I was not much of a president. I preferred being in law. I managed to make a 16th Amendment about income taxes. I started a remodeling of the Supreme Court building in 1929. I coined the term dollar diplomacy and helped Latin Americans in the United States oh in the United States economy. I was the largest <laughs> president of the United States. I got I got stuck in a bathtub and had to <laughs> bring in a king sized tub into the White House. I was the first president to open a baseball game by throwing a ball in 1910. I was the first president to be buried in National or Arlington National Cemetery. I was the only president ever to be Chief Justice and the President of the United States. I was a hardcore Republican.